Nope. 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 Oh! Here's the homework that's due in five minutes. I should have come out it two minutes longer. Once upon a time. Welcome, you two travelers. I don't know about you, but I am a professional at putting off today what I can do tomorrow. That means I procrastinate. A lot. And this is not a healthy habit. We constantly tell ourselves, oh, I'll just browse the internet for five more minutes. I'll, I'll just watch one more episode on Netflix for, you know, it, it's only 20 minutes long. Next thing you know, it's 10 minutes until your assignment is due and you have not started it. And that's for students. When you get into the real world, the consequences for procrastinating are much higher. So why do we do this? If we know that procrastinating is going to cause us so much stress, why in the world don't we just tell ourselves, just get it done? I have two words for you. Instant gratification, our greatest nemesis. According to the Urban Dictionary, instant gratification means immediate satisfaction or the quick attainability of happiness or contentedness. That means that even if you're one of those crazy people who doesn't hate homework, like me, you'll still go after the thing that makes that you think will make you happy in that instant. For example. All right, let's see what we got for homework today. Ooh, I get to write a paper about the espionage and intrigue of the Cold War. You know, that actually sounds kind of cool. Come in! Hey, I was just wondering if you want to go see this really cool movie that's coming out. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not too busy. I just have a paper due in the next couple days, but yeah, you know, that sounds nice. Let's go. Okay, let's get down to this paper. Do you have time to go grab a bite to eat? Um, well, I have a paper to write, but... You know, I deserve a break after class. That sounds nice. Dinner sounds amazing. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! What?! Hey, I just finished my homework for the weekend. You want to go hang out? I can't. I have so much work to do. And this paper is due tomorrow. And my room is a mess. And this process of procrastination and then every form of anxiety building up on you happens to me about once a week. And I keep telling myself I'm going to be better, but it never happens. I procrastinate on working on procrastination. It's that bad. But you know, is it all that worth it to try not to procrastinate? Because even if you're the early bird, all you get is the worm. Now for the most important part. Tell me your stories about procrastination. Tell me your struggles and trials. Do it right now. I just knew you needed another excuse to put off what you're supposed to be working on. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, keep on imagining. Can't actually jump. If I jump, the whole thing jumps. Oh.